Many of my students confuse different vowel sounds in British English. So in this video, we're going to look at how to make the five uh, basic long vowel sounds in English. And I'm going to show you how to understand the position of the different parts of your mouth. So, for example, we're going to need to focus on where we have our, our jaw, okay? And the jaw is the part of your mouth that can be closed or it can drop down and be open, okay? Like Pac-Man here. And the other part of the mouth that's very important in this video, uh, that's the lips, okay? So we're going to need to do quite a lot of smiling today. And even some kissing. It's quite exciting. Okay, so as I said, we're going to look at five basic long vowels in English. Okay, and the first vowel we're going to look at is over here in this position. And that means that the jaw is closed. And we're going to have to do a kissy shape with our lips. Okay. So close your jaw, keep your teeth together, push your lips out into a kiss, and you should be able to make this sound, which is mm. Now you try. Okay, did you make a nice ooh? Now oo is the sound that you hear in words like you. Okay? Okay, now the second sound we're going to look at is over here. So we're going to keep the jaw closed, but uh, no more kissing, I'm afraid. Now we're going to do some smiling. So keep your jaw closed, but put your lips out in a wide smile. And you should be able to make this sound, which is E. Okay, listen again, and then you try. And the sound E is in words like me. So over here we have oo, which is in words like you, and then over here e, like me, you, me, oo, e. So that's kissy. And that's smiley. Now the third sound today is going to be between kissy and smiley. So you're going to relax your lips, very relaxed. But you're going to open your jaw. We're going down here now. So drop your jaw down. And you should be able to make a nice relaxed ah oh, sound. Listen again and then you try. Ah. Oh. And that's the kind of sound you might make when you see a cute puppy or a kitten or a baby and you just say, ah. Oh. Now you'll find this sound in words like car. So we had you, that was oo, me, that was E and car, that was R. Let's practice those three sounds together because they go really well one after the other. So first of all, I'll say all three sounds and then you repeat them when I'm finished. So I'm going to start over here and I'm going to move in a circle shape like this. Are you ready? Just listen. Ooh -ya. Okay, now you try. Okay, now I said there are five basic long vowel sounds. Okay, we've done one, two, three sounds. So now we need to do number four. And number four is going to be over here. That means we're going to close the jaw a little bit 
and we're back to kissing again so stick your lips out and make a nice oh sound listen again and then you try oh now it's easy to remember because we've done one two three sounds already if you do them in order this one's number four okay there's one sound left now where do you think it is remember we started here and then we moved in a circle shape now we're going to spiral into the center okay so it's not kissy it's not smiley it's not closed it's not open in the center is nothing you need to relax completely and that will give you this sound uh. listen again and then you try uh. that's the sound I sometimes make after a hard day's work listen and repeat work and those are the five long vowel sounds I'm going to repeat each sound with the example word you repeat after me ooh you e me ah car or for uh, work and we'll finish off by saying all five sounds together listen and repeat after me Ooh, e now you try Well done. All you need to do now is practice. Why don't you watch the video again until you can get all the sounds correct. In another video, we'll look at the basic short vowel sounds. But thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.